Welcome to our channel. In this video, our goal is to help you improve your English while enjoying an interesting story. Our content will help you both learn new language skills and refresh your general knowledge, making it fun and educational. We hope this experience will bring you joy and encourage you to keep learning and growing. Let's dive in. Smiling is something people do everywhere. When we smile, we show we are happy. A smile is a way to show our feelings. But why do we smile? It turns out that smiling is not just about feeling happy. It is much more than that. Smiling is also good for our health and well-being. When we smile, the corners of our mouth go up. Our lips move around our teeth, showing them. Our cheeks lift up towards our eyes. This is how we smile. But did you know that smiling also makes your face muscles stronger? Smiling is like exercise for your face. Humans smile a lot. Even babies smile. We do not need to learn how to smile, it just happens naturally. This is because smiling is part of who we are. It is a natural way for us to show our feelings to others without words. Babies smile to communicate with their parents, to show that they are happy or that they want attention. We smile for many reasons. We smile when we are happy. But we also smile when we are nervous, afraid, or when we feel uncomfortable. Smiling can be a way to hide our true feelings or to make ourselves feel better. It can be a way to make a difficult situation feel a little easier. Imagine you see an old friend you have not seen for a long time. You smile because you are happy. You do not even have to think about it. Your smile happens naturally. Smiling is our body's way of showing joy. It can bring a feeling of warmth and comfort both to us and to the people we smile at. We also smile to show we are friendly. When we meet new people, we smile. This shows that we are not dangerous. It is a way to say, I am friendly. I want to get to know you. Smiling can help us make new friends. A smile can open doors and make people want to talk to us. Sometimes people smile when they are scared or unsure. They want to look friendly. It helps them to make a connection with other people, even if they are feeling worried. Smiling can help reduce tension and make us feel more comfortable in new or challenging situations. Smiling can make us feel happier. Dr. Nakia Gordon is a teacher of psychology. She says we do not need to feel happy to smile. We can smile even when we do not feel like it, and this can actually make us feel better. It tricks our brain into thinking we are happy, and then we start to feel that way. You can smile even if you are not happy. When you smile, you may start to feel happy. Smiling helps our brains feel good by sending signals that create positive feelings. Smiling is like telling your brain, everything is okay, you can relax. There are different kinds of smiles. Some smiles are real, and some are not real. Real smiles use both our mouth and our eyes. These smiles show real happiness or excitement. When people smile in a real way, their whole face shows their feelings. A French doctor named Guillaume Duchenne studied smiles. He found that real smiles also use the muscles near the eyes. When someone is truly happy, the muscles around their eyes move, creating small wrinkles. These are often called smile lines, and they show that a person is genuinely smiling. Fake smiles only use the mouth muscles. A fake smile does not move the eyes. When people smile like this, their face can look tense or forced. Real smiles make our eyes close a bit, and they also create small lines around our eyes. These lines are a sign of real joy and can make others feel more connected to us. People can often see the difference between a real smile and a fake smile. Real smiles make people trust us more. When someone sees a real smile, 
they feel that the person is being honest and friendly. This makes them want to connect and talk with that person more. Men and women smile for different reasons. Women tend to smile more than men. But this does not mean that women are always happier. Often, women are taught to smile more because society expects it. Smiling is seen as a sign of being polite and friendly, especially for women. Women may smile more because they are taught to do so from a young age. In many places, smiling makes you look approachable and easy to talk to. Women may feel that they need to show they are friendly, while men may feel pressure to look serious or strong. Men often want to look serious. They may think that smiling makes them look less strong or powerful. Women, on the other hand, may feel like they have to smile to make others feel comfortable. This difference is because of the way people are taught how men and women should behave. Smiling is different in each culture. In some places, like the United States, people smile a lot. It is common for people to smile when they greet each other, even if they do not know each other very well. Smiling makes people feel comfortable and welcome. In other places, like Russia, smiling too much can seem strange or even fake. People may think that someone who smiles a lot is not being serious. In these cultures, smiling is only done in certain situations, such as with friends or family. Scientists studied smiles in Japan and the United States. They wanted to see if people think smiles are friendly. They found that people in Japan and the United States look at smiles in different ways. What makes a smile friendly in one country might be different in another. In Japan, people look at the eyes to decide if a smile is friendly. They believe that the eyes show real emotion. In the United States, people look more at the mouth. A big smile with teeth showing is seen as friendly and happy. In the United States, People use big smiles to show their feelings. It is normal to show big emotions with big smiles. In Japan, people do not always show their feelings with large smiles. People may smile less, but their eyes can show that they are happy. People also smile when they send text messages. They use smile emojis to show their feelings. In Japan, the smile emoji often has a straight mouth but happy, curved eyes. This shows the importance of the eyes in their culture. In the United States, the smile emoji has a big, curved mouth. The eyes do not change much. This shows that people in the United States focus more on the smile shape of the mouth to show happiness. Smiles are important. They can make us feel better. Even when we are sad, smiling can help us feel good. It can change our mood and help us feel more positive. Smiling is like a small step towards feeling happier. Smiling at other people can also make them feel good. A smile is like a gift you give to someone else. It makes them feel happy, even if just for a moment. Smiles are a simple way to make the world a better place. Mother Teresa once said, we will never know all the good a simple smile can do. This is true. Smiling is powerful, and it can change how we feel. It can also change how other people feel and make them feel loved and cared for. Smiling is a part of being human. It helps us show our feelings and connect with other people. When we smile, we send a message of kindness. It can make others feel safe and welcomed. When you smile, your face changes. Your mouth moves, and your eyes close a little. It makes you look happy, and others can feel your happiness too. This connection is important in making friendships and building trust. Even babies can smile. They do not need to learn how to do it. It is natural for all people to smile. Babies smile when they are happy, and they also smile to make a connection with their parents and caregivers. Some smiles are real. 
They come from true happiness. Some smiles are fake. They are for being polite, like when we meet new people or when we are in an uncomfortable situation. Both smiles are important for different reasons. A real smile makes lines near your eyes. A fake smile only moves your mouth. Real smiles are more powerful because they show true emotions. People trust real smiles more than fake ones. People can see if a smile is real or fake. A real smile makes people trust you more. It shows that you are honest and that you want to connect with others. A fake smile can sometimes be useful, but it does not have the same effect. In different places, people smile in different ways. In some cultures, people smile a lot, and it is normal to smile at strangers. In other cultures, people smile less, and smiling too much may seem strange. In some cultures, smiling is a way to show respect and kindness. In other cultures, smiling can be seen as a sign of weakness if done too often. Understanding these differences can help us communicate better with people from different places. People use smile emojis in text messages. These emojis are different in different places. In some countries, the mouth is the most important part of the smile. In others, the eyes are more important. In Japan, the smile emoji has happy eyes because people believe the eyes show true happiness. In the United States, the smile emoji has a big, happy mouth. This shows how cultures see smiling differently. Smiling can help you feel better. Even if you are sad, a smile can make you feel happy. It may seem simple, but it works. Smiling sends positive signals to your brain and it makes you feel better. When you smile at other people, it makes them feel good too. Smiling is like spreading happiness. When people see you smile, they feel happy, and they may smile back. We all smile. It is a part of who we are. Smiling helps us show our feelings without words. It helps us connect with others, and it is something that everyone can understand. So, remember to smile. It can make a big difference in your life and in the lives of others. A smile is a simple act, but it is powerful. It can change your day and make the world a better place. Thank you for watching our video. We hope you enjoyed learning about the power of smiling. Smiling can improve your mood, help you connect with others, and even make the world a brighter place. If you have any thoughts, experiences, or questions about smiling, please share them with us in the comments below. Your feedback means a lot to us, and we'd love to hear how smiling has made a difference in your life. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe to our channel for more content to help you learn and grow.